there. I'm Becca. This is Keith. And this is our home, Vagari, which means to wander. And that's the plan, to wander around the world on our sailboat. After 19 days at sea, we arrived in Belize, navigated through a barrier reef, and dropped anchor. Oh, holy shit. Can you see that water? clearance from the health department, we were able to check into the country through Immigration and Customs. We then spent a few days enjoying Amber Face Key. Alright, local ice cream. Thank you. Mm. Alright, what flavors did we get? Snickers, mint chocolate chip. This is Snickers. Snickers. Mint chocolate chip and sweet corn, which is like a local, local flavor. Is it good? Delicious. for coconuts on the beach and leaving Jean and Jake behind to continue their exploration by land, Keith and I took off on the boat and sailed further south to Key Cocker. San Pedro, Belize to Key in approximately 15 to 20 knots of wind, sunny skies, 85 degree temp, blue, clear water with about four feet underneath us. And yeah, and that's that. We got uh, the dinghy up there and Bessie sitting back there riding behind in the corner. And uh, we're making about, uh, what are you making, about six knots? Yeah, six knots. Six knots, just a head sail, just a head sail. All right, well, there you go. sailboats here. Looks beautiful.
Yeah, perfect. Yeah, okay, I like hot. Yeah. Right. Better be careful. It's yeah. hot. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So here's, here's oh, our mid morning snack. That's a lot of food, yeah. boys. Yeah, Where did we get this from? Jenny's? Jenny's? I don't know. We got to sit down and start this food. This is too much for right We got to appreciate this. You ready? Go for it. Is this your first fry jack? One more. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's nice. How is it? Oh, man. It looks amazing. Oh, look how fresh it is in there. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. It's way better. And oh, that but... is a burrito. <laughs> After a few more days of beach and water activities, along with the nights full of music and rum, we said goodbye to Jake and Lindsay as they headed back to the States. Keith and I continued further south through Belize, alongside Ann and Brian of our buddy boat, SV Pelican. Since we couldn't step foot on Key Chapel, we picked up anchor and sailed further south. The lobsters they caught, so we have one just hanging in the cockpit because he doesn't want to stay in a bucket. And the other two, yummy over here. Yum yum. About to be a late lunch slash dinner situation. Sorry guys. Where you at? Uh, in Belize. In a lagoon. A lagoon. Lonky, there's our friends from another buddy boat, Pelican. This is the lagoon. This is where we're at. We're towing our dink, uh oh, towing our dink on our paddle boards. Probably not very efficient. You watching the sunset? Yes, ma'am. Sundowner? Sunset Just goes on forever. Jean met up with our mutual friend, Tom. In order to come join us, they jumped on a boat making a fresh vegetable delivery to St. George's Key, as there aren't ferries or other public transportation to the island. All together, we sailed south, making a quick stop at Middle Long Key, then continued onward to the picturesque island of Tobacco Key.
Water Key or South Water Key, Belize. There's Pelican on the left and Vigari on the right. And a little bitty island. And Tom, Becca, and Jean out swimming in the coral area. Easy, easy. He's, Go. Not, he's not happy. Yeah, well, what's right, Tom? After soaking in the island life and tossing back the Barracuda, we sailed off to Placencia, a small town on the mainland. From there, we could take a water taxi to a nearby town and check out of the country with immigration and customs. After a full month in Belize, and with hurricane season underway, we planned to head south for Guatemala, take the boat upriver a few miles inland, and wait out the hurricane season there.